in this video we will learn how to ask the user for input until they give a valid response such as we ask user to enter or prompt the user to enter their age and if they don't enter a number it will throw a section and we are going to continue and from the user again to enter the valid age we can use int to parse the age let's see example we can use a while and make it true and then we can use a try block and we can now prompt the user to enter the age and we can save user age by parsing it and prompt the user to enter the age please enter your age and if there is an exception in parsing then we can use accept and value error and we can print a message that print please enter valid age and we can continue again and move to prompt by using continue statement and if uh, everything is okay user entered the valid age then we can use a else block and we can break from this prompt And then we can just do some check if user age is greater than or equals to 18. We can print some message. For example, you can vote else we can say you can vote you cannot vote the main code is over here here we are going to keep from the prompting the user to enter a valid age until the person enter the valid age we will keep prompting the user because if a person enters something uh, as such as a string instead of a number the exception will be thrown and we will be in this block and we will print this message please enter valid age and we are going to continue again okay? to this part if the person enters the valid age we will break by going to else block and then we can just check the age and print these messages we need to remove this extra round bracket this column is in over here And now we can check our script. Please enter your age. If I enter 25, then it said you can vote because we entered valid date. Now we try to enter 
some uh, non valid date or wrong date so i'm just gonna enter hello you can see it prompt us again and also print this message please enter valid age so i'm going to again add a valid date now but less than 18 so let's say you can add vote this way you can keep prompting the user until the user entered the valid data to keep on learning, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Keep supporting me and thank you for watching.